how to hard reset the Google Nexus 5 back to the factory settings using the hardware key. Now if your phone is stuck or not responding, then you might have to opt to use the hardware key. Also before you back up, um, before you reset, make sure you back up all your important data such as contacts, uh, music, movies, documents, because uh, performing a hard reset will cause the phone to wipe out everything and go back to the factory default. Okay, let's go into it. First, press on the power button and hold it. From the pop-up, tap on power off, tap on OK, and this will switch off the phone. Next, we need to press and hold to the power key and the volume down key to go into the recovery uh, menu. So press both buttons at the same time, press and hold. Once you see it vibrate and it come up with the screen, let go of all your fingers. Now you can use the volume key on the side here, the up and down key to navigate to other menu items. So if I press down once, we go into restart bootloader, press down again until you see recovery mode. Once you see recovery mode, press on the power button to make the selection. Now you should see an Android icon um, appears. So you see it said no command, that's okay, this is a good sign. So next what we need to do is press and hold onto the power button and then press and release the volume up key quickly. So this one's hold and this one press and release. So I'm going to press it, hold, press and release. Once you, are, once you see this um, Android system recovery screen, then you can, using the, so I'm just going to move my phone in so you can see. So from here, using the volume down key or volume up key to navigate to the next menu item. So if I press on the volume down key. So go down to wipe data or factory reset and again press on the power key on the side here to make the selection. Now so what do you want to do? So let's go down. You need to press on the volume down key seven times. One, four, five, six, seven. The reason they do it seven times is that they want you to make sure really sure that make sure that you really want to delete everything. So that's why they force you to go down seven times before you can actually choose the right option. So this time, go down to yes, delete all user data, and pressing on the power button to make the selection. So now at the bottom here, you can see it's say erasing, and here it's a wipe data formatting data. So I guess at this stage, your phone is getting formatted, and all the data is now wipe off your phone so we just give it a few moments it shouldn't be text it shouldn't take too long so using this method is also good if you need to uh, sell the phone to someone else you can uh, format it before you um, you pass it on. So here's the formatting cache. So I say data wipe complete. And now at the top here, it go back to the menus, and simply uh, press on the power button to select reboot system now. So I'm just gonna press on that, and it's gonna reboot the system. So once the phone started, it should go back into the factory settings and you should see it present you with a first time setup screen. So you will need to go through the whole setup process again if you want to go back and use back into your phone and using it. And that is pretty much it. So I hope this uh, short video um, is helpful and show you how to hard reset the phone. I just wait for the phone to start so you can see the setup screen. It can take quite a while because this is the first time that it boot up so it's just trying to initialize a few things. But that's it. Thanks for watching this video.